Hello, this is Paul for your friendly review of the MacBook Pro 2016 LED bar. What I like about it, real quick. Number one, you'll be able to log in with this Touch ID here, the fingerprint reader. That is useful to me. So that's one thing here. Number two, I like to be able to change the volume there. That's really quick. Uh, very nice. You can slide it around. I don't know if you can see this. Very quick and easy. And then number three, if I bring up a video here, which I'll turn the volume down, which you can see I just did by sliding um, my finger on the mouse, and the trackpad is so nice that it's not really necessary. Um, I do like that I can also search through the video using the slider bar. So, those are my likes of it. Uh, beyond that, what else do I think about it? That's all I really use it for. Um, I've, I've tried using it for internet. I'm looking at the different uh, menus and such. It's kind of a low resolution bar, but I think it's fine. I don't really miss the function keys. It's fine. It's really not the something that's that great and groundbreaking for me, in my personal opinion. I do think that this is a uh, it's interesting. Maybe there's going to be more uses that come out, but for me, I'd rather just use the shortcut keys and the trackpad, and I can do everything from there. I just, uh, it is handy sometimes when anything that has a slider on it to not necessarily have to find it with the mouse um, to just to do this and just, just slide it with your finger there. Maybe further along, there will be more interesting things that come out with it, but for now, I would not make a purchase solely based on this OLED bar. If you have the extra money or you need the extra processing power, then maybe you can go with it. But uh, definitely nothing that I would really jump up and down and go after and say, I, I've got to have it. This has been Paul for your 2016 MacBook Pro LED bar review.